Well, staying with news about the U.S. President Donald Trump, and he has denied that he was cleaning house at the Department of Homeland Security. And following the sacking of top-level officials from the department, the U.S. media is calling the departures a systematic purge taking place at the nation's second largest national security agency. Because the list of departures from the Department of Homeland Security is so long, it started with Security Secretary Kirsten Nielsen, uh, which is followed by Secret Service Chief Randolph A. And now the acting deputy secretary of Homeland Security, Claire Gady, is on her way out. But what are the reasons behind the biggest security shakeup since Trump came to power? Well, the U.S. media report, uh, say, reports say that Trump is furious with the department's alleged inability to reduce unauthorized migration to the U.S., causing his signature election campaign to devolve in public. There have been several reports of Nielsen and Trump clashing over immigration issues during her 16 months on the job. Her departure had long been rumored, particularly after her criticism of the administration's 2018 uh, family separation policy at the Mexican border. Well, I never said I'm cleaning house. I don't know who came up with that expression. We have a lot of great people over there. We have bad laws. We have a judge that just ruled incredibly uh, that he doesn't want people staying in Mexico. Uh, figure that one out. Uh, nobody can believe these decisions we're getting from the Ninth Circuit. It's a disgrace. And so we, we're fighting the bad laws, the bad, the bad things that are coming out of Congress. You have a Democrat Congress that's obstructing. You talk about obstruction, the greatest obstruction anyone's ever seen. All they have to do is spend 20 minutes and they can fix this whole problem. Trump has also declared that he's not looking into reinstating the much-criticized practice of separating migrant families, but he says that many more migrants are streaming towards the U.S. through Mexico because the practice no longer is in place. Just, just so you understand, President Obama separated the children. Those cages that were shown, I think they were very inappropriate. They were built by President Obama's administration, not by Trump. President Obama had child separation. Take a look. The press knows it. You know it. We all know it. I didn't have — I'm the one that stopped it. President Obama had child separation. Now, I'll tell you something. Once you don't have it, that's why you see many more people coming. They're coming like it's a picnic, because let's go to Disneyland. President Obama separated children. They had child separation. I was the one that changed it. Okay, thank you very much. And Trump had ended the practice under pressure last year after footage of scores of migrant children housed in fenced-off cages at the border facilities was broadcast widely. But now Trump's allies are pressing for a harder line on immigration as he continues to clean house at the Homeland Security Department.